Hello guys, today we start off our Champions League run against RB Leipzig in the group stage and we do have Napoli in the league. So let's get into it, let's cue that intro. Oh no, and welcome back to the Roma career mode as me, Dan, back again. And today we do have two games up for you guys today. We do have RB Leipzig and we do have Napoli in the league. So just before we start, I just want to say thank you guys for the recent likes and comments recently. And I just want to say thank you to all new subscribers for subscribing. So thank you guys for that as well. And if you ain't yet hit the subscribe button, please hit that subscribe button as it does really help. And don't forget to like the video as well. So thank you guys for that. I'm running out of energy. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Right. Anyway, uh, today we do have two games uh, up for you guys. So let's get straight into it. Lee, we do have RB Leipzig in the Champions League. So let's see if we can beat them. Obviously, it's going to be the uh, one of the main teams who will be challenging us for the group stage, I think. So, um, yeah, it's a definite must win, obviously. We're at home as well, so let's see what we can do. And obviously, we will be playing the second team, so let's uh, put the second team in and let's see if we can beat them. So let's get into it. Let's play match then, shall we? Oh, great through ball to Tammy Abraham, and that's 1-0. What a through ball it is from... Uh, Almeida, it was just crossfield ball towards Almeida. He cuts inside and waits for that run from um, Tammy Abraham. Tammy Abraham, and it's a great, uh, for a great through ball, and it's a great goal. And we've got our first goal in the game. Takes a touch, gets it, makes sure it gets past the goalkeeper, and there we go. That is one nil. It's Tammy Abraham with the goal. Was there Emery on this right hand side breaking on the counter? Oh, great play from the young Frenchman. That's going to be a corner. Right, Robertoni with the corner. That's a great corner. It's Almeida. Oh, what a header. That's 2 0. He likes doing them little headers, doesn't he? At that front post. It's always Almeida at that front post, and he scores. So there we go 2 0. From that, uh, from that corner, great corner from Robertoni. Great header, outleads the defender, looping header, goalkeeper, absolute no chance. And there we go, that is 2-0. Two 2-0 nil. So two nil And there we go, so there's full time and we do beat RB Leipzig. 2-0, Almeida and Abraham with the goals. Uh, but yeah, big three points in the group stage, especially against a group, uh, yeah, group rival. Would you say? I'd say they are. Um, so yeah, we'll definitely take those three points. So let's look at the match facts and match highlights of the game. So 49 to 51 in possession, four shots to their three. Um, Thiago Almeida does get man of the match with a 9.3. No, uh, no surprises there. He got a assist and a goal. And let's look at the highlights of the game. We do have Tammy Abraham with the first goal. Great through ball from Abraham uh, from Almeida. And then it's a great finish from him. And then uh, a good save here from Karnazecchi into uh, one of their players. And then, yeah, good save from Karnazecchi. And then, obviously, Almeida with the second goal. Looping header over the, over the goalkeeper and into the back of the net. So there we go. That is that game. So 2-0. We'll take that. Um, especially going into the next game, uh, into the next Champions League game, which is against Royal Antwerp, if I'm not too mistaken. So, yeah, we'll uh, obviously we want all the three points that we can get. Um, so, yeah, that's good. Uh, first things I need to do before the Napoli game, I need to change the tra training plan to all of these players to balanced because obviously some of these players are going to be uh, playing like. Um, like the first team and the second team. So now the second team will get a rest before the Napoli game. So let's advance towards that Napoli game where Z Emery does want to play in this one, but we're go we've got bigger games coming ahead. You can play the next game, which is against Florentina, if I'm not too mistaken. Yeah, so next episode, we'll uh, do a couple of games 
Um, we've got Florentino, we've got Royal Antwerp, and we've got uh, Salernitana. And then uh, if we've got time, we'll do the game against Juventus as well. Uh, so let's go into our next game against Napoli. Um, so let's do the pre-match report. And we shall do the press conference as well for this game. And hopefully it'll be a, a same game like it was uh, in the last game um, where we'll have chances and hopefully we'll get to score two or three of them. Um, so let's see. Right, so let's kick off against Napoli. And then we shall see. So yeah, first team in, so let's get into it. Let's play match then, shall we? Oh, great cross. That should be a goal. And it is. It's 1-0. It is Trent Alexander-Arnold with his first goal for the club. It's a great goal from out the back post. Normally don't see him in the box, but he's made that run into the box. And it's a great goal. Great cross as well. Pressured mountain. Hakimi on that right-hand side. Just puts it into the box. And all it needed was someone to put it in at the back post, and it was that guy, Alexander-Arnold, at the back post with a side volley, and he puts it in right before half-time. So there we go, 1-0. One nil. One nil, oh. Right, Dybala with the corner. It's a great corner, great header, and it's a great goal, and it's 2-0. And I think it's Alfonso Davies. It is Alfonso Davies. So there we go. 2-0. It's Tabala with the uh, with the cross from the corner. And it's a great goal. So there we go. 2-0. It's a great finish. Great header from the left back. Obviously, he's not normally in the box in real life. I think he's normally at the back post. <laughs> Um, but we'll take it. It's a great goal and a header. Maybe goalkeeper should be saving that. Um, but we'll take it. So there we go. 2-0. So the ball rolling again. 2-0. And it could be in proper trouble here. Oh, of course it's a goal. Of course it's a goal. 2-1. Um, it's a 90th minute goal. I literally tackled them so many times and they just could not literally got the ball back so many times it just fell back to them it was the 90th minute of course they had to score um it's 2-1 thankfully it's just a consolation goal but yeah 2-1 um consolation goal wouldn't be surprised if that's full time as well yeah no surprises there right so there we go guys that is that three points against napoli so that is really good um but, you know, it's just annoying that we couldn't keep a clean sheet, but we'll take it. So let's look at the uh, match facts. So match facts, 70-30 in possession. We had, they had seven shots to our three. That, that is pretty much our game, really. 8.5 for Trent Alexander-Arnold, 8.3 for Davies. And the match highlights, let's have a look. So Akimi got a yellow card. We don't have to see that. This save from Alisson, which is a good save, um, went down low. And then, yeah, good save there. And then, obviously, Trent Alexander-Arnold scored. We get the ball to Akimi. At the back post was Trent to put it into the empty net. And then, uh, oh, and then Alfonso Davies' his goal. Great header uh, from the corner. Lubin header, great finish from him. And then Raspadori with a goal. Um, yeah, he's just, like, nicked it, didn't he, really? Um, there we go. Can't really do much about it, but there we are. Right, so let's go into the post-match interview now then and see what's what. Um, I think that will probably be it for today. Um, next episode, I think, uh, I do believe we're going to do a, a couple games simming, aren't we? I do believe. And then uh, we've got, I think if we've got time, we've got Juventus as well. Um, so that is the plan. So anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. So please like, comment and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. So right, guys, I'm going. Bye.